Oh, this is an oblong one. Oh, good view. I'm gonna look it. I'm gonna like it. <laughs> I want to. I would cross the rock guard, and we get to a bar <laughs> in East London, and they've sold out of everything besides for white tequila, black sambuca, and potency. And Albert can't drink white and tequila, tequila or black, black sambuca because he's vomited on it. I have vomited on everything. I'm laughing. I'm still drinking. So we had a big potency. You lost. That is why. That is your only off bad. <laughs> yes, as you can think of stuff on the lease and nothing will really happen to you. I know. I think I've weed purple, man. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, you mean, um, uh, that's a very good question. <laughs> no, Jackie, what do, you, what do you mean? When I was younger, I uh, wanted to be a professional tennis player. My whole, and even as a rock and roll musician now, my whole lifestyle is more health based. <laughs> I'm big into sport, I'm big into sort of health and fitness. But um, yeah, I was doing the full thing, coaching all week, went overseas even for tennis. And then when I started losing a little bit of interest in that, I was playing with Gareth in this little garage band. And all of a sudden life just got so nice doing music and doing all the different things. And yeah, music took over. Paul and I have been playing together all our life, as long as we've been playing. Um, we've been fighting and blacksmithing each other and playing guitars and drums together for 20 odd years. And Tammy went to school with us and she played cello. I don't think we picked Albert or Albert picked us, it just kind of happened and I think that's how it should be, you know. I mean, others are all taken it. <laughs> <laughs> no, no we, 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 we used to be a four-piece and um, we always joked, like, when our guitarist quit, we didn't really want, we didn't want to go back to a four-piece, we wanted to be a trio, like a power trio. And we always joked, we're like, well, maybe we'll just phone Albert, ha ha ha, you know. So that would be the dream. And that would have been the dream, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is pretty cool because he's all of our favorite guitarists in the country and uh, probably Albatross Trio is the coolest live act to see so it's kind of that. We also had such a good response from the song that he played with us especially and we thought it definitely has to be a collaboration and show it off to the rest of the country. I've never eaten so many takeaways in my life as I have on this tour. Albatross is like, oh I'm hungry, let's go get steers or Oh, I'm starving. We have to have a McDonald's burger. I should tell you who the fuck's it is. Dude, like, is it? Oh, man, that's crap. Crap, yeah, but you just get in my mind. Let's go. Let's plug it in. But that's like, oh, that's like, super hard case, man. I've got all hard cases. that because I, I play golf. <laughs> golf is what I do pretty much all the time. I had made a tour with flat out every guy that got the golf clubs. I think Neil Young plays with 11 handicap. Alice Cooper's was a two or three handicap. Yeah, but see, not many. I've, I've only ever done one other thing with other than music and I sold slip slops at a surf shop. I thought I was going to be telling ladies how they looked in their bikinis, but sadly that wasn't the case. I was in the back room counting slip slops, and I think once 
the music became a reality that it, I could actually make a living off of it and that is the only other job I ever had it was quite an easy choice which route I was going to go I, I just knew that I wanted to go on tour with this band or just do something musical from from school so yeah uh, brilliantly I'm playing with uh, with three really really um, talented musicians we're doing something that's completely uh, completely fresh and uh, it's fun because for a long time I stagnated and didn't write or do much playing with different people so to me it's great to have a little bit of like an outlet to to get stuff out you know, and uh, ideas I've been gathering for years I can finally finally put on a table and it works it all, it all works so it's a hell of a lot of fun as soon as everybody listens to everybody else, the whole thing clicks into another dimension. That's been really nice because it's there's a big respect between all, all the players in, in this group. So and that's what the nicest thing, you know, that and, and, and crack a smile on the stage, you know. Like have fun. That's the whole idea about playing music. You have to play music, you don't work music, you play music. Hey babe, what's your name? You little fox you. Every time you walk on by, I want to touch you. Every time you shake that ass, I love a lady with a little bit of bath. Hey babe, what's your name? I want to love you. That time me in the deepest part of the ocean. What's your name? I I'm always keen. How many is five minutes good for you? Five minutes is going to cut it close, but it's a good job. <laughs> 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 what are you doing? What did he say? He's, what are we getting his guitar? What are you doing? Uh, I've changed some strings. Ah. He said, like, a flourish. He's being like Gina. He said, Gina uses a toaster. He's hectic. That's so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> Why isn't that Yeager going, dude? Eh? Why isn't that Yeager going? You guys are going to watch Jaeger, there's no Jaeger. What are you doing? Yeah. Uh, I got to go to the Jaeger. I need three Jaeger. I was coming to downtown. <laughs>